We're going to go to Lincolnshire to speak to former Chief Immigration Officer Kevin Saunders. Kevin, very good afternoon. The Prime Minister saying that uh, in light of this tragedy this morning where five people, including a seven-year-old girl, died in the Channel, he's saying this underlines the need for the Rwanda scheme, why it will be a deterrent. Do you agree? I do indeed. We can't have these awful things happening with people dying in the channel. It's absolutely outrageous that this should happen and a small child dying is even worse. Um, and from, from what the reports are, it, it looks as though migrants, fighting amongst migrants was the cause of it as well, which is, oh, it's just unbelievable. So, yes, we need Rwanda. We need to stop the boats coming across. And at the moment, the only game in town is Rwanda. So that's what we've got to go with. Because it, Yvette Cooper's... It. Sorry, Kevin, I just wanted to, to put to you what um, Yvette Cooper <laughs> said, calling it an extortionally expensive gimmick and that uh, border security should be boosted instead. And that's the way to go about it. Oh, dear me. I, I, get, I get very upset when I hear this because, realistically, we've been trying to, to stop people coming across the channel now for 25 years. We were very successful eventually in my day um, with the lorries. We managed to virtually stop it all. We're, that is why we now have the boat. And if Ed Cooper comes up with... with well, I'm afraid our ideas won't work. Um, they, they just won't work. It's interesting because the Labour Party has this refrain that all you need to do is smash the criminal gangs. But, I mean, as far as I'm aware, the government has been sending out teams to smash these criminal gangs, seizing depots of, of, of equipment as far away as Turkey. But, but I suppose when, you've, when you're playing whack-a-mole with these gangs, that's incredibly hard to do at source. It, it is virtually impossible. These gangs, as you so rightly say, are sitting in Turkey, enjoying their coffee and making oodles and oodles of money. Now, we can't send a British bobby out to Turkey to arrest them. We need the Turks to actually work with us. And the Turks are saying, well, show me an offence that these people are committing in Turkey and we'll deal with it. But they're not. They're not committing any offence at all in Turkey. Therefore, the Turks are saying, well, you know, what, what, what do you want us to do about it? So the idea of us sending British bobbies out to Turkey to deal with it is just nonsense. Well, Kevin Saunders, thank you for the, for the blunt appraisal that you've given there. It was uh, not, not, not perhaps the most cheery uh, assessment, but my goodness, what a big issue we all face. Thank you very much for joining us, former Chief Border Officer, of course.